Hello gladiators and welcome to the Coliseum. In today's match we'll be starting a new series and it's Pokemon Ruby version randomizer Necrolock. Now a Necrolock is a nuzzle lock that me and my fiance made up. So while um, Professor Birch, I think his name is, is talking, I will explain the rules. Now all these rules will be in the description below, but I'm going to start now. First off, this game requires randomization for it to be in effect. So I did randomize it, that's why it's a random weapon. The second rule is you have three tries to capture a wild Pokemon. But after that first try, you have to cut you have to sacrifice a Pokemon of a equal or or a level within or <laughs> Okay, let's start over. You you but after that first try you have to sacrifice a Pokemon of within five levels to capture a second encounter. If you then decide not to catch that second encounter, you can try for a third, and whether you catch that third Pokemon or not, you will have to sacrifice one of your Pokemon within five levels of that Pokemon. All right, the next rule is if a Pokemon dies, it's dead, put it in a death box. But what you need to do is make two boxes, a purgatory box where they go for um, where you can bring them back and then a, like a death box or a hell where they will die forever because once you sacrifice you can't sacrifice again So make two poke boxes for each type um, Next is you have to nickname all your Pokemon, but by its type so if it's a Chimchar It's like blaze or something or if it's a Asmorel, it could be Agua it Doesn't have to be that lame, but you know what I mean So it's gonna ask what we are. We are not we're a girl, but we're gonna play as a boy Let's name ourselves something like Tom. Let's be Tom. We're awesome like that. <laughs> anyway, um, our next rule is right after every gym victory, you have a choice of sacrificing a Pokemon within five levels of the one you want to revive, or none at all. This includes box Pokemon and void if anything activates after the battle or after the gym. So what happens is you can... Um, you have a Pokemon that's alive, you just beat the gym, so you're going to run to the Pokemon Center, go to the PC box, and you can revive one Pokemon that's within five levels of the Pokemon you're going to sacrifice. So if I have like a Jirachi at level 10 that died, and I have a Trico at level 11 that's alive, but I beat the gym so I can run to the Pokemon Center, sacrifice my Trico for that Jirachi. But once I sacrifice Trico, I cannot bring him back and he has to go into that death box that is void for any more revivals. And you can do that after every gym leader as long as you don't go anywhere else besides the Pokemon Center after. Once, if anything else activates any cutscenes, any, um, you talk to anybody, then it is void. Okay, our next rule is if you defeat your rival without losing any Pokemon, you can revive a Pokemon for free. Yeah, it's because you only battle your rival every once in a while. So, just whenever you beat your rival without losing any Pokemon, you can revive one without sacrificing. Um, you can catch legendaries, but they equal two party boxes, so they include their party box and one below it. So, yeah. Um, legendaries also have no level restrictions for revival, so you can sacrifice a Lugia to revive your Bulbasaur, and your Lugia can be at level 10 and Bulbasaur can be at level 50. Um, and our last rule is if you sacrifice a Pokemon for another, you cannot use that Pokemon again and must release or put it in a piece of PC box that is untouchable. Alright, let's see what time it is. It's 2 o'clock. So yeah, that's all the rules for our Necrolock. I know that's a lot of rules to go by, um, but I am... This will be fun. Me and my fiancé are doing a co-op of Fire and Leaf Green. And it's going pretty it's going pretty smooth. I mean, we've kind of I think we've broken our rules a few times mostly because we weren't we're unsure. But um yeah, so this um doesn't activate till I get Pokéballs, so this first episode might be a little kind of boring, but I am actually just going to skip this. I know we've all seen it. We've all played Ruby and Sapphire. Ruby's my favorite. That's why I chose this. I didn't want to play Emerald again. Uh let's see. We can go to our we have to go to this guy's house. So yeah, that's our rules. I hope you guys will enjoy this as much as I will. It's it's interesting. My fiance came up with it first. He was um, 
He was just thinking of something cool and then we kind of grew off of it and made our own nu nuzzle lock. Called the necro lock. Necro meaning death, so that's why, you know, you have the death and the sacrifice. And if you know what a necromancer is, then a necromancer can bring stuff from the dead and use it. Kind of like a zombie. So yeah, I thought that was that was cool. This would kind of be good for um, Pokemon Snakewood because, you know, all the dead Pokemon and stuff. Anyway, here's our rival, May. Yes, I don't really like May, so that's why I didn't choose the girl. Actually, I don't like May at all. So I didn't, I didn't know. No. So now we can actually go up to the next route. We, can, we won't be able to catch Pokemon, but we do get to pick our starter. It is random. It should be anyway. I sure hope so, because I don't want to record this. Anyway, so there he is being chased by a Poochyana sucker. What you doing in the grass without the polka bag, you crazy man? Alright, let's see. We got a Smurgle. We got a Tauros. And we got a Mawile. Let's do a Tauros. I've always liked Tauros, but I've never used him. So here we go. Tauros. I was hoping for something awesome, but Tauros works. You know what? I am not complaining. Wild Poochyana appeared. Go Matoros. What should I name him? This is like cow. I'll name him cow or moo. I will name him moo. Moo moo milk. Ha! Ah, I will do that one. It's genius. Alright, one hit shot. I think Tauros probably has a high attack because of the normal type that he is. <sighs> Professor Birch, you're so funny. Why? Why are you out here being crazy and stuff? Anyway. Let's see, he's, he's saying we did it, yay! We actually have to go battle his daughter. And then... Oh, we received Tauros! But we have to go battle his daughter. Yeah, that's never fun. Moo Moo. I don't know! <laughs> I'm actually not sure if I... Oh, it'll fit too. Moo Moo Milk. I don't know if I randomized the trainers or not. I think... Okay, I might have- I guess we'll see. I guess it'll be a surprise for both of us. Yeah, I'll go see your daughter. You just want to hook us up. You're crazy, because you know I'm going to be the Pokemon Master, and I'm going to kick all the asses. Oh, yes. Oh, yes, I am. All right, so let's go up. Um, any of these encounters don't count, and if a Pokemon dies, that doesn't count either, um, because we don't have Pokeballs, so we're just in a normal game at the moment, so I'm actually going to just speed through this battle, because... Cool, we can get a gold duck in this grass. We can also get a gulpin. That's even awesomer. I love gulpin. I don't know why. I've never used it, but I love it. It's so adorable. Yeah, I know. I'm gonna heal for no apparent reason, but we are gonna get May, and I never I don't know what she's gonna have. Since I chose the middle, I think she might have a fire, but I'm not sure. Hi, I work at the Pokemon. Can I get you to come with me? Come with me, darling. Come come buy my drugs, please. All right, we, we got a potion. We got some crack. Some crack for our crack. <laughs> okay, let's go up. Before I keep talking, let's go up. A counter in this route also doesn't count. I know this first episode is really slow. Um, it will get better once... Oh, I was hoping not to run into... A Bulbasaur! Ah! We are catching a Bulbasaur. We are doing it. But here's May. Craptastic, I hope we don't lose. I guess we'll see if her Pokemon is randomized, though. By the way, Bulbasaur is my favorite Pokemon. So we're catching one. That would be so awesome to use Bulbasaur in generation... What is this? Three? Or two? Oh my god! Really? Really? <laughs> you mean this whole game I have to deal with this? Holy crap! Oh my gosh. Rival is a troll. You're a troll, Rival. Get out of my face with your Entei. What the heck is this? She's supposed to have like Jirachi or something. Oh my gosh, she's gonna kill me in every... I don't think I'm gonna make it through this now. I have no confidence at all. Oh my gosh, Tauros, you can, you can do this. Crap. I was expecting something awesome, but not something that friggin' awesome. Well, at least we get a lot of experience for it, I guess. We should've called Moo Moo Milk uh, Hunchback. Look at him. He looks so funny. I'm not dissing anybody with a hunchback. I'm just saying. Alright, well we beat our rival who has a freaking legendary. Okay then. Well, it's time to die to blah, blah, blah. We have to go back to the lab. Um, this is where we will get Pokeballs and then we can start this Necrolock. Yeah. Let's go buy some potions. 
Yeah, let's go buy some potions. It'll be good for us. I think we get running shoes too, I hope so. I don't like walking. I'm lazy. So we got some antidotes and we'll get two or potions and we'll get two antidotes because poison and a uh, nuzzlelock type variant deal are not good together. They do not combine at all. Hurry up, Tom. I love my name, Tom. That's awesome. If you have a name, Tom, congrats to you because you are a famous Pokemon trainer who has a Tauros and who has a rival with an Entei. So good luck with your journey, Tom. We look so cool. I never played as the guy character and he looks awesome. I always played with the girl. I'm so glad that I chose the guy in this one. In the other one, he has green stuff on. He doesn't look as cool. Oh, hi, Tom. I heard you beat May on your first try. That's excellent. May's been helping with my research. Yeah, apparently too long if she has a freaking Entei. Alright, well, we got the Pokedex. We gotta help Professor Birch fill it up. But guess what, Professor? It ain't gonna happen because I can only catch a Pokemon per route. With. Well, actually, I can catch three Pokemon. Well, one per route, but I can try three times. Isn't that nice? Isn't that nice? But I can't at this beginning because I don't have any Pokemon to sacrifice. And I would totally just lose. Alright, we got our Pokeballs, guys! The Necrolock has started! Woo! Okay, let's, let's go see what we can encounter. I'm sure hope it's a Bulbasaur. Wait, Tom! Tom, Tom! Did you introduce yourself to Professor Birch? Oh, what an adorable Pokemon. You got it from Professor Birch. How nice. You're your father's child, alright? You look good together with Pokemon. Here, honey, if you need these, these are running shoes that'll put a zip in your step. Why don't you just give me coffee? Freaking coffee will work. I'll be bouncing off the walls. It's like I'll have the walkthrough walls cheat on. Yay, mom, you're awesome. Shoes. Zoom, 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 zoom. All right, guys. All right, guys. What are we going to get? What are we going to get? What is it? Oh, my gosh. What is it? Yeah! Ooh, a Marowak. That's cool. Let's hope we don't kill it. Holy crap. I didn't think of that. All right. All right. Let's see if we can catch it. Let's see. Tackle. Oh, snap. He has a high catch rate, though. Man, how many Pokeballs do I have? Five? Oh, that's what I hate about these randomizers, is they have a high catch rate when you run into Pokemon like this. And then you can't catch them. All right, come on, Marowak. You want to be mine, I know it. Just, you can bring your bone to the good side and keep it out of the bad side. Nobody wants to be boned by your Marowak. No, it was almost there. Darn it. I know if I tackle it, I'm gonna kill it. Oh, I can't believe this thing is already giving me a hard time by starting out with Entei. You know, you could have gave me like a better Pokemon than Moo Moo Milk. No offense, Moo Moo Milk, but really? Something that I had like another move, like a little tiny move that won't kill this Pokemon? Oh well. We can always try another time, but we're out of Pokeballs. Yeah! I was waiting for the ball to like spark like in black and white, but it doesn't do that in this game. But we caught Marowak! Marowak is the evolved form of Cubone that has overcome its sadness at the loss of its mother and grown tough. Oh cool! This Pokemon is tempered and hardened. Spirit is not easily broken. I will break you. I will break you, Bone. What should we name him? Bones. Yeah, I know, lame, right? But we did it, yay! We got our next Pokemon so fast. That was so crazy fast. This is awesome. Already got a Tauros. Already got a... I gotta write this down. Tauros. And Marowak. Alright. She hopes to see us again. I'm not even gonna add a death box until one of my Pokemon dies. Because that won't happen. I won't let it... But let's go buy it, use the rest of our money on Pokeballs so we can go catch that Bulbasaur that's up there. And we will catch that Bulbasaur. 16, 18, yes! We can buy how many? Nine Pokeballs, man? I need more than that! Especially because there's three routes right up in the front. We have Route 101, 103, and I think 102. Alright, let's see what we find. We found Bulbasaur in this grass. Come on, Bulby! Come on, baby! 
Oh, Nidal ran. Oh, that's okay though. Nidal ran. Nidal ran ain't back. He's got that Nidal King by his, in his jeans. Uh, I can't talk. He's got that Nidal King in his jeans. Let's hope I don't kill him though. Oh. And he won't have a high catch rate. He looks so adorable in this game. That is adorable as heck. Oh, we have 10 Pokeballs also. Come on, it around. Oh, darn it. I know what I'm gonna name this Nidoran. I know what I'm gonna do with it. And Blackleaf, you know what I'm gonna do with it too. You know. Come on, Nidoran. Oh, you're such a trolling face. Come on. Just be good. Be nice. Be nice. Yes! Oh, that's so weird how it catches it. It doesn't- it just pauses. It doesn't, like, spark or anything. The male Nidoran has developed muscles and for moving its ears. Thanks to them, the ears can be freely moved in any direction. Even the slightest sound does not escape this Pokemon's notice. Give a nickname, too. Alright, I will name this Pokemon after one of my lovely subscribers, Blackleaf. 55. Um, I want to thank you for all your support. So you are going to be in my team, Mr. Blackleaf. Also make sure to check out his channel and subscribe because he has awesome videos of Pokemon and Crash and more Pokemon and some Mario Party. So go check him out. Alright, let's heal up. We are going to actually go to the next route and what, catch a third Pokemon? Holy crap. Look at this. Look at this. We already have a bunch. I'm so excited. But we have no money. That's the bad part. Do you battle me? I'm going to catch a whole bunch of Pokemon. And we get... Ooh, a ghost Pokemon! Claydol! Oh, Spurt. I miss you. Oh, I don't think any of my techs are going to work on this thing. Pokemon. Shummery. Oh, he has Bone Club, and he has Peck. Bones, you come out. Because I don't want Black Leaf to die. Use Harden, you dirty boy. Alright, I guess we will use Bone Club since... It doesn't affect him. Of course it doesn't. Uh... I don't want him. It's okay. I don't want I don't want this clay doll. And the good thing about this is I can run into another Pokemon, and if I want it, I can catch it and sacrifice, but if I don't want it, then I'm good. But if I run into a third one and I want him, I have to announce it. I know this is really confusing, guys, but it makes Whoa! A Snorlax! Taco! 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 Death! Oh, we learned Rage. That's awesome. Maybe we should put somebody in the front, huh? There we go. Blackleaf, come on. Show me what you got. Let's see if we get any new ones. Any nice ones. Like Bulbasaur. Ah, oh, Dedrio! No, I'm good. Thanks, though. You're poison, sucker. That's right. Okay, I want Blackleaf to beat this guy, so... Let's see, we got a Nidoran. Alright, I like to I like to write down what I got so I know. Okay, one more attack. Should do it. And then Blackleaf, you will be awesome. Come on. Come on. Yeah, go Blackleaf. Level up. I think he level. Actually, I think I need a Moonstone to evolve. No, I need a Moonstone to evolve him into Nidoking. King. This is awesome. Okay, I guess I should probably end the episode before I get too carried. Come on, before I get too carried away. All right. Actually, I want to say something about about the Necrolock. So I ran into my first encounters here, and I didn't catch neither of them. So now I can go for a third try. But I would have to announce it to you guys by saying I'm gonna try to catch the third Pokemon. And by saying that, um, 
that means whether I catch that third one or not, I still have to sacrifice a Pokemon. So I just want to let you guys know that. Um, I'm not going to announce that now because we're going to end the episode. So thank you guys so much for watching. Like and subscribe. And I will see you guys next time.